हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू द चैनल वन शॉर्ट टाइमर यस फ्रेंड्स दिस इज द टॉपिक ऑफ दिस वीडियो आई विल शो यू हाउ यू कैन मेक दिस वन शॉर्ट टाइमर विद द हेल्प ऑफ आर्डिनो एंड फॉर दिस प्रोजेक्ट आई विल यूज आर्डिनो यूनो एंड वन एल फॉर आउटपुट एंड वन पुश बटन फॉर अवर इनपुट फ्रेंड वन शॉर्ट टाइमर इज दैट काइंड ऑफ टाइमर इन विच यू अप्लाई इनपुट ओनली वंस and the output remains high for the preset time for the time you set so first of all i show you the coding what is the code so you can see my screen i have set uh, output on pin number 4 here and input on pin number 7 for output i have given name output led and for input i have given name input uh, push button pv pv for push button and uh, then next is uh, a variable which is long unsigned because it uh, will have the largest larger value actually because this will save the value of millis this gives you the value in millisecond and this value is uh, much higher and next is uh, preset time i have made this integer int value because uh, uh, we will use the value maybe 10 20 for this project i am using only 5 5 second this value will be in seconds and uh, next is count variable it will hold the uh, status of uh, push button how it will work you will see it further in the code so our first function is void setup in this function i am setting the mode of the pins first of all you see output led is set as output and initially i have set it low with the help of digital write function output led comma low so this is low and next pin input push button pin is set as input but not only input i will set it as input pull up because i will not use any external register now we go to the code loop loop in which our main function will be running continuously so first i will check the status of my input push button so you, you see here if digital read input put, push button is low why i am checking low because by default it will remain high due to input pull up right then in this condition i will save the uh, current value of millis in this register previous time and i will make this variable count 1 because it will uh, save the status low status of this push button and along with this i will also uh, make led high so led will glow i am using digital write output led dot high and after that here i will use this count register i am using here while while count is equal to 1 as far as it is 1 this code will be running right so if we go inside this while loop then you see here i am again checking the value of previous time actually i am checking here millis current value minus previous time if this value becomes equal or greater than our preset value preset value is our 5 i am using here multiplication of 1000 because uh, as earlier i told you that millis uh, gives a uh, uh, u value in millisecond so to make it uh, millisecond i am using here multiplication of 1000 so here i am checking basically the time which i set earlier whether it has been passed or not if it is passed okay then it will run this code it will make output led low so our uh, led will stop glowing and along with this uh, count variable will be again zero so it will come out of this condition and this loop and this loop will be stopped if i press button push button once then my led will be high and it will remain high for 5 second in my case 
you can change this time uh, this time at your end you can make it 10 second or whatever you want to make it so now uh, I will check this code on Arduino board then we will see is it working or not so let's go to the board so friends uh, I have downloaded the software our code into our Arduino board so I will show you how it is working so this is my output and this is my input if I press my input push button then output will be high and it will remain high for 5 seconds right so I am pressing the button pressed and it will remain high for 5 seconds right so our code is working fine so you can check this code with your own time maybe 10 seconds 20 seconds so friends uh, thanks for watching have a good day